Hello guys, today we are talking about the 7 deadly sins as Roblox Bear Skins. I haven't posted a bear video for over a year because the game got boring. So yeah, I made this video based on the 7 deadly sins trend. Without further ado, let's begin. Here comes the money! Here we go! Money talks! Here comes the money! Okay, the sin of greed is this definition. And we all know what it is because of the SpongeBob character, Mr. Krabs. The sin of greed could apply to Kenyob, but he got changed to HOBHOB. Well, the sin of greed might go to the rich skins as well. But the sin of greed goes to Golden Biking. Yeah, this skin, you have to pay to get him, plus, he is just a freaking reskin. This ruins the second game of Bear. And which is why the OG game is better than the first game. Bear Store might have high quality, but this skin ruins the charms. Yet yeah, Cheed says he's not greedy, but this skin itself represents the money people pay, and how Bear Star is kinder ruined. Sorry I'm ranting, but the skin best represents greed in a fun way. Forgot to mention that greedy could be greed, but I don't really see the greed into him. And tasty? The sin of gluttony is basically eating too much or consuming too much of anything. Well, the sin can go to the big boys of bear, but the sin goes to chef. What are you? An idiot sandwich. Idiot sandwich what? An idiot sandwich chef. You may be like, what you're thinking and why is chef gluttony? Well, he is because he is a fat guy, according to his remake. And he is a chef, so he does cook food, which is what gluttony usually relates to. You might be thinking, why isn't a Nick Kid, Big Man Ting, or even Big Chungus gluttony? Well, this is because their species is already big, and we don't know if they even consume tons of food at all. So Big Chungus became big to mock someone. The sin of sloth usually refers to laziness or not putting effort in what you do. The sin of sloth could go to any of the basic bear alpha skins, since they are bears with items slapped to them. The bear that basically fits well with sloth might go to bear alpha's dinner bone. He is basically just the basic bear, but he's upside down. The contributor became a contributor just for flipping a bear upside down. To add to the sloth, the person only made one contribution, and it's only by flipping a bear upside down for contributing. No wonder why Tux didn't credit him. Artificial love, we just make it up, cause reality will never be good enough. And even if it was, we just mess it up. Lust is basically having strong sexual desire for someone or something. Well, you can say lust can be Kane or Idiot Bear, because the creators did some pretty disgusting stuff to other people. But I'm excluding them because they are very personal, and the skins don't really represent it. Well, for fun, the spot that goes to lust might go to Rob himself. Since he is Rob, he is the most handsome man to ever exist, and it makes sense because he's the boss of the Valentine's event. Well, because of his handsome looks, he started becoming the center of attention like giving him a deer and a survivor skin for him as well. So Rob is lust overall because of not what the disgusting creators did, but because he is overloved by many people and he has the handsome looks. Wrath is basically strong anger or a deep hatred of a person. The wrath I'm giving to might be basically a lot of the boss skins. Basically all of them are bosses that rule with the power of wrath, disliking the survivor and attacking them for no apparent reason. All of them are bosses that rule with anger and hatred. 
You can say Sam is wrath because he burned atrocity, but in reality, he is trying to do the right thing according to his history. Yeah, I put bosses together, since they are basically murderous beings that are hateful, for the survivor and cyber, Sam, might be different than normal Sam. So yeah, all the bosses are hateful for the survivor. Better than me, my shape up better, my car faster, my trip better, my clothes fit better, my hoes better, my tattoos better, I'm stronger than you, my bitch thicker than yours, my gun's bigger than yours, nigga, my gun's bigger than yours, I talk better than you, I hustle better, I can get a dollar quicker than you, I talk better, I walk better, my shoes fit me better, I get paid more than you. The sin of pride basically means being obsessed with one's own self-image, and basically be self-obsessed. The sin of pride might go to Lagoon because of how rich he is, and how he is more superior than Whitey. Well, he got turned into a disaster, and he kinda goes to wrath. Well, the sin of pride might go to Team Dirk himself. Yeah, he could be prideful because of how epic and colorful he is. Well, he is pride because his badge from Bear Star is an item given by meeting the creator himself. Well, since it's rare to join him, people will show how much better they are by owning the skin, and how they officially met Cheaty Men himself. Overall, Team Dirt fits pride because of how he looks and how prideful he is, and the way he is obtained. The sin of envy basically is just jealously, but more specifically. It's resentment towards another person's success and fortune for yourself. Well, the sin of envy easily goes to the Christmas thief himself. Basically, if you are living under the rock or never seen it before, he basically is envious of others having a good Christmas and so just to ruin it. He steals Christmas items from others just to have it himself. That's basically all the seven deadly sins of Bear. If you don't agree with the list, you can comment which one goes the best. Also, this video isn't to slander or call out any people, but this video is for educational purposes about the seven deadly sins. Well, if you like the video, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Well, Saya and I could make the seven heavenly virtues next.